over there.
son of a bitch! Well, what do you know? Looks like we got ourselves some kind of hero. Let's see what you got, amigo. Draw your weapon. Howdy.
Keep your eyes wide open, brother. There are Indians everywhere. Sometimes it seems like they appear out of thin air. Section! Hurry up! We need help! Welcome, stranger. Take a look around.
Kill you. seen my notice? I'm looking to hire some guns. A fellow by the name of Snipes wants to take my land. He sent one of his men to intimidate me and I had no choice but to kill him. More of his men are on the way and I can't handle them all. He'll get you a hundred cash if you help me take care of them. It's all the money I got. Listen up. They'll be here soon. Get on the balcony and wait for my sign. have a death wish the only thing I'm wishing for is you in a pine box <laughs> Got a lot of grit, Mr. Freeman, I'll give you that. But I think you better fetch the deed to this land. That is, if you ever want to see your daughter again. Yeah, that's right, we have Rebecca. And she's a pretty little thing. But she won't be once we're done with her. You got one hour to do the right thing. One hour, you hear me? Not Rebecca. God help me. I sent her away two days ago to see my sister in Kansas. Those sons of bitches must have been watching. I'm flat busted. I gave you everything I have. I'm begging you. Please, don't let those killers get away with this. Please.
You don't know who you're messing with. My name is Snipes, and I have more than a hundred guns back in me. Lost and found. You done with it? Don't worry about me. It's time to talk to Mendoza and his amigo, the smuggler. You sure about that? Let's go! Mendoza said to lay low for a little longer. You attracted a lot of attention. I've had enough laying low. Hold your horses, Ray. Can't hurt to stay in hiding for a little bit. Well, fine, little brother. Let's hide then. At their hideout. You are one impatient son bitch. We're looking for Juarez. That's the boss. I know that some bitch from somewhere. Hey. We're looking for Juarez. Did he pull out? Mr. Mendoza has decided to continue his journey without you. Barnsby? He didn't like the idea at first, but I convinced him it would be in his best interest to leave you two behind. 
Ray and Thomas McCall. I made a blood oath on the flag of the Confederacy that I would hunt down every deserter who fled my command. Because of cowards like you, Atlanta was burned to the ground. My wife and children murdered in their beds. Meanwhile, subhuman animals are now free to live among the decent Christian folk. Free to do whatever they want. Fornication with our women. Misogynation. Colonel, you will pay for your betrayal. You will die a coward's death and you will burn in hell for all eternity! <laughs> Colonel Jeremy Barnsby never laid down his arms when the Confederacy surrendered. He raised an army of disaffected Southern soldiers who weren't yet ready to admit defeat. He led his men west through Arkansas and Oklahoma, where they robbed banks and trains and hijacked supply convoys. Hounded by the U.S. Army, they were driven south to Mexico, crossing back and forth across the border, continuing to fight a war that had ended years before. Hunted down by the Pinkertons, Barnsby was captured in Arizona. He was awaiting extradition when my brothers unwittingly liberated him. I'll ask again, why does Juarez need the weapons? There's three of you, so if I beat one of you to death, it's really not a problem for me. It's payment! For what? The medallion. Please, don't hit him anymore. William! He's gonna kill him, Ray! What medallion? Look, there's a legend about lost gold hidden in the hills outside Juarez. I've heard of it. What of it? The medallion is the key to finding the treasure. Juarez is exchanging the rifles for the medallion. My rifles? <laughs> yes, sir. But they're useless. He paid almost nothing because they're worth almost nothing. Spit. Apaches. Juarez is swindling them. Is that where he's headed? Apache territory? Yes, northern Arizona. They have a guide. Good. Sergeant? Yes, sir. Hang him high. What about the boy? He needs to hang, too. For aiding and abetting traitors to our glorious cause. How did you know those rifles were useless? Who told you that? Me. So leave him alone. You? Well, that's interesting. And who told you?
Can any of y'all move? <laughs> me? No, they tied me tight. You see that saw? Cut your binds and untie us quick. But I don't know if I can... Easy, brother. You can do it. All right. Now us. Come on, come on, hurry up. Someone's coming. Ready. Someone's coming. Take the chair. It's the only weapon here. Son of a bitch! Oh! There's more. Thank you, Lord. They're running away! Don't let them get away! What now? Let's look around. You look around. Oh, brother, you jump and climb like a damn mountain lion. Me, I prefer firmer ground. You see a road? Yeah, downhill. <sighs> Great. Just don't expect me to do any running. Look out! Get into one of those death traps? Let's do it, brother. Oh, back on Earth at last. Now! Son of a bitch! <laughs> <laughs> This time we don't rush in like a bunch of chickens with our heads cut off. How about this time you shut your mouth and let me do the thing? 
thinking? Oh no, are you kidding me? Yeah! One more! It's a drawbridge. Try to get over there and lower it. Cover me. Sucker was dead before he hit the dirt. Slowly. This better be the end. Together. On three. Like we're stuck. I look around. elevator fine but I don't somewhere up there. Someone will have to trigger it. I guess someone means me. I'm sorry, brother, but I'm just not too good with heights. Well, you're gonna have to learn, because as soon as that elevator starts up, you and William gotta be inside it. Stay here and cover my ass. I'm gonna do a little jumping and climbing. Well, how the hell are you planning on getting down? I'll find a way. You got any better ideas? All right, go. But I'm saying right now, I don't like this. Come on, William. William, why didn't you tell me what Mendoza had planned? Thomas asked me to keep it quiet. He said you talk too much. <laughs> Someone is not being frank here. Hey! 
All right, it goes. Get inside, William. Lord, be merciful with us. 